morning, everyone. Ryan Arzi here with Foiling Magazine. We're at the Gorge, Hood River, AWSI, meeting with Ollie from Starward to go over some exciting new products with really unique designs. So can you tell me a little bit about this wingboard? Yeah, this is the uh, wingboard range. Um, I'll bring it out here so you can see it. So the wingboard range is uh, our entry level wingboard and more free ride focused. Uh, this is the smallest, so this is more of an advanced shape, but so like 50 uh, liters. Yeah, this yeah. is, uh, yeah, the 50, 55 no. or 50 liters. Yep. Yeah. Um, and then we have the bigger boards behind us in the, in the light tech construction as well. And the wing board is a, a very unique shape in terms of it's a short compact board. So, uh, less length than yeah. you. So it's easier to trim and we're really focusing on having the volume kind of on the rails and nose and tail, which allows us to really have a very thin um, standing area. So you really have that connection and direct control right. when you're up and riding. Um, really, really helps kind of give you the control. So this is, you can see here, and it's a really unique shape. So the wingboard is, is kind of inspired from also the windsurfing development. Right. So you can see it's got some fairly kind of um, progressive cutaways at the, the tail of the board, which helps kind of release yeah, the angle um, and just helps you pop up. One of the other other upgrades on the, the new wing board for this year is we've added a lot more V in the nose. So mm. kind of on touchdowns, it's it's going to bounce back up and um, taking off, it's a little bit less drag. Yeah. Um, yeah. So yeah, the wing board is, is available from 4.4, which is this model, up to the kind of seven foot. Right. Which is much nice for um, beginner and entry level people getting into the sport. Totally. That's rad. This is the blue carbon construction, which is our kind of lightest uh, and then the light tech is a uh, amazing value price point awesome that's cool and so we have another version yeah. of a wing board there the takeoff so the takeoff is a freestyle wave um board for winging so these boards start from kind of the 30 liters so that crossover and prone foiling yeah um, and, and, and more sinker board, right yeah sinking um up to again the seven foot which is behind us over there so these boards, a um, bit more traditional in shape. They have kind of flatter deck through. Um, what is unique about these is how forgiving they are on touchdowns. Mm. So all the feedback we, we've got from people trying these boards and when we're developing them, they're really nice when you're, when you're coming down. They've got a, a kind of moderate nose kick, but they've also got some tail kick um, in the rocker. Right. And that really just makes it really easy to pop back up. Yeah. Um, Compared to the wing board, it's got a more narrow nose. So for kind of freestyle jumping uh, and in the waves, you're less likely to catch that nose through turns. Mm. So it's um, really nice and kind of flowing. Um, Very all smooth on the bottom. Yeah, kind of exactly. That's really, yeah. um, pretty kind of basic bottom shape. So it's pretty much a flat throughout. Um, and then we've got, a, again, a, a nice little kind of pointed cutaway at right. the tail, which again, just helps that relief and pop. Yeah. Um, all of our boards have uh, quite long track boxes, so you can really have a good adjustability. Um, we have from 14 up to 16 inches. So nice. Um, yeah, you can really, depending on the, the, the conditions you're riding in and what you're trying to achieve. Uh, and this, so in all of our um, wing boards, we have from kind of 14 inches up to 16 inch boxes. So uh, that gives Should you a lot of flexibility yeah. there to, to move your foil. And if you're using different foils, uh, you can really tune that to the conditions and, and your style of riding. Right on. And so I see you have an inflatable here as well. Yes. So this is uh, the airfoil. So um, this is uh, got a patent um, and it's unique in terms of it's got a carbon top plate here. So um, oh, this whole right area is a composite right. carbon plate. Um, we also have an alloy version, uh, but the carbon is up to two kilograms lighter, which really makes a big difference when you're, when you're rider. Sure. So by having this composite plate where you're standing, once you're up and riding, it feels like you're on a hard board because that's, that's all you're connected to. And you have the foil directly connected to the plate. Yeah. I've so, never seen that before. Exactly. That's, that's what really gives you that control and that connection again. Right. So it, it, you're not having kind of four inches in between you and the foil, you really have that direct feel. So there's like no flex. Exactly. Ah, yeah. Wow. And, and generally the problem with 
you know, the airboards is that, you know, there's a ton of disconnection, but that's, yeah, yeah that's really and, cool. and obviously the, the great thing about the inflatables is more easy, compact to travel with. So if you are going on a trip or you want something that can pack down, right. Nice. Uh, you can kind of have your, your foil, your wing and your board all in a pretty small package. And that's crazy. This is 73 liters and it's yeah. only 411. Yeah, this is 411. <laughs> so this is the smallest in the range, but we have a number of sizes yeah. um, for different skill levels. But uh, yeah, this has had a lot of uh, good it's feedback. A lot of volume in there. Yeah. Also got the edge release here. So having that nice sharp release from the tail, um, uh, which gives you kind of that and, early thing. And then this is like a filler piece. Yeah, this is a filler here. So that's going to just help you um, kind of create less drag and just hold totally. back up. That's really cool. And then last but not least, it looks like we have a downwind, light wind wing board here. Yes. So I think the one of the biggest uh, hyped products in the show is is definitely the downwind foil boards. This, uh, if I bring this out, yeah. see a bit closer. Uh, this is our eighth downwind foil board. So in SUP, we used to have a, an ace race board. We scaled that down and this board is fantastic for uh, light wind winging. Yeah. Um, you can see this, this one has the foot strap inserts as well. Um, so you can really get up quickly. It's so really that, that narrow tail helps you pop up and the more kind of narrow pulled in longer limp. Yeah, and that when you're up and riding, it's kind of really fast in the air. So it has actually a good wind range, so you can go quite fast. Totally. Um, but also this is a, a downwind sup foil board. So we've had a lot of fun pump foiling this in Thailand on the lake. Yeah. Um, just paddling up and down water, up, yeah. flat water paddling. And then, uh, yeah, in, in the downwind conditions, it's, it's great. Uh, we have four sizes, so from 6.9, which is an 85 liters, and up to the 140, 710. So this is the 120, right? This is the yeah. 120, this is a 7.4. Nice. Um, and again, extra long track, so you can really yeah. tune where you want the, the foil. Um, but yeah, we see a lot of interest in, in both light wind and the SUP downwind. Totally. So you can do a lot with these boards. Exactly, yeah. you have a lot of versatility in a lot of value. And I've never seen anyone put rear foot straps, which is cool. Cause yeah. yeah, you have, you know, both those options. When we were testing this, it was, uh, we were actually going high speed winging as well. Right. By having that option of adjusting the straps right. helped a lot. That's cool. And do you use this paddle most of the time? Yeah, you? between yeah. the Lima uh, and the Enduro, there's a different preference. I yeah. would actually use the Lima uh -huh. just because it gives you a lot, a lot of power. Right. Um, but yeah, the, the, the paddle is uh, all it. Yeah, this is the, the adjustable. And I think that's quite good for people when they're getting into it. Obviously, when you're up and riding, having that adjustability with a paddle help. Totally. So you can paddle pump and yeah. everything. Exactly. Well, Ollie, thank you so much for the breakdown. Really exciting to see these new boards. And I'm sure that's going to do really good this year. Thank you. Yeah, right. it's, uh, excited. Yeah, cheers.